few months, you might have noticed some new tunes playing at certain targets. Some remodel stores have new speaker systems that rotate more than 1,000 songs. Target says it's a way to improve the shopping experience. So how does music affect customers? Good question. Heather Brown found herself humming along today. What do you think of the music? It's like typical radio. Sometimes I like the song and I just kind of start dancing. <laughs> and if it wasn't there, it'd be just really quiet and you'd hear... You know, other people shopping and things dropping. At the Roseville Target, we heard Katy Perry, Justin Timberlake, and a 90s song I like, but just can't remember the name. I think it's a half a step up above elevator music. I'm taking it you don't love elevator music. I don't know anybody who loves <laughs> elevator music. <laughs> Lots of us do, even if we don't know it. The more background people understand it's a background music, the more they feel like, hey, I'm more relaxed. Wayne Mueller teaches marketing at the U. And Target is basically saying we've got to differentiate ourselves. Studies have shown the music's tempo matters. People move more slowly to slower songs. Target says it doesn't know yet if that means more sales. People do come to Target with a few things on their list and end up coming out with a few more. So hopefully music plays into that. Music genre also makes a difference. What's a good Target shopper song? Upbeat song. In some research, classical music can make people buy more, but it can make them think the store is expensive. I love it, but not when I'm shopping for new placemat. One study in a wine shop found when employees played French music, people bought more French wine. Same for German. And this was when customers weren't even aware of what they were listening to. Did you notice it until I pointed it out? Mm. No. I did not. What? How much we pay attention? Yeah. <laughs> the music is in 10 Minnesota targets now, 180 by the end of the year. They don't have a live piano player or anything, no. so. <laughs> no, they don't. Heather Brown. Maybe we su could suggest that one. WCCO. Four news. Uh, some research has shown that music can also make waiting in line go or feel faster. And volume matters. You'll notice that Target's volume is much lower than what you might find at an Abercrombie and Fitch. That's like a rock concert yes, in those places. Very loud. Yeah. If you have a good question for Heather, please email it by going to wcco.com links.